feel like a lot of these girls, including myself, are not in a good place right now. And I know that I can bring them together. Yes, I love it. And wait till like it gets a little darker. Oh yeah. I'll look even like really pretty. Yes. If any of us can do it, it's me. Alexia. Larsa. You look amazing. Cha cha cha. You brought your eggs. Of course I did. Oh, here comes the hot mama. Hey, how are you? Good. Hey, how are you? This is the moment for everybody to all come together and put our differences aside, a refresh, a restart, and figure it out. Because I know at the end, we all like secretly love each other. Wait, you are the problem in this group, whether you like it or not. Julia, for power. You're a devious, devious woman. Stop it! Stop it! I thought we were going to have a great night. walking this morning. Take advantage of having the beach in your backyard. You know, I don't make the time to come down here to look at the ocean. I'm like, always, always, always on the go. It's time to slow down a little. Next phase, you know. Kids Does that mean going, I'm getting My old? kids are going to college. Yeah, they're not yeah. getting older. You phasing through life. Right. Todd and I have been together for almost seven years, so it doesn't really feel like I'm a newlywed. And, you know, we're just working on being better together and being stronger. How's my tan? Almost as yours, except you yours tan. is natural. You're very tan. But it's been a growing process. That doesn't happen overnight. But what we do know is that we're super in love and super into each other and we want to grow old together. I've done a lot of self-reflection, and even the video that you did, apologizing to Anthony. Anthony, please accept my sincere apologies for wrongly mentioning your company on TV in a derogatory way. TV got the ugly out of me, and I'm really sorry. I was not aware that Todd was going to do this on social media. I didn't like that he didn't tell me because I was probably going to tell him, babe, please don't do it. Not because I didn't want him to apologize to Anthony, but because, you know, I just wouldn't have done it publicly that way, maybe. It was it was nice of Todd to apologize to Anthony, you know? I think he owned it, and it, it is what it is. I don't think he needed to make a social media video about it. He could have probably just called Anthony. In life, we do a lot of stupid things, and we have to apologize for that. I don't think I've ever given anyone a nine-minute apology, and I've done some pretty things. I truly thought we were fine to discuss the possibility after seeing the scene play out on Shopee. I would understand that he truly thought here I am. It was just a lot of talking. I'm not going to talk about that video anymore. That ship has sailed. So I've been thinking about um, having the girls over for a dinner with their husbands or with their partners. The theme is Nuevo Horizontes, which is New Horizons. So let's just like Forget about the past and just let's like focus on living the moment and having like an amazing moment and future together. I want to be, you know, good with all the girls. And I think if everybody's ready to move on, you'll see it in their behavior and everyone will have a good time. If people are going to still hold a grudge, you can't solve that problem. If it's your home, you set the tone for everything goes. I promise to do that. Okay, so. Let me know, let me know the time and the place I'll show up. You, you better show up. Now watch you leave. But I have nothing planned for the next couple of weeks. I'm available. <laughs> I'm going to make sure you're there. I need you there, because you see, you make me so peaceful. No, I'm, I think it's going to be great. Cheers. I brought you Cape good weather Brown. and I brought you a nice boat. So <laughs> no, next just, time you go on the cold boat, there's a big difference. Let me get a photo of the two of you. Love is in the air. Love, love, love. <laughs> I love the commentary. Marcus and I have been dating for about 10 months. It was like a friendship that evolved into more. It wasn't like, let's set the internet on fire. Let's just get together. 
I kind of was hesitant, but I feel like the more time we spent together in Miami, the more I realized, like, he's my guy. He's not anyone else's guy. He's really my guy. Marcus already knows the drill. He takes the best photos. I try. Wait, wait, do you get down low? <laughs> oh, I, I get on one knee, you know? I'll hide behind a tree I'm, if I I'm, have I'm, to. I'm thinking know, he's gonna I'm, propose, I'm all he's doing is taking a photo. <laughs> yeah, exactly. There's a lot of gossip, obviously, about your relationship. How does Marcus feel about it? I think Marcus knew what he was signing up for also. Like, he knew being with me was not gonna be easy. 23 carats are, are bigger. Right. <laughs> but I really focus on the haters. People are always mad. I don't care. I don't live my life worried about other people. And I feel like the people that are in my life and Marcus's life that matter are happy that we're together. I miss having a ring on this finger. For sure. <laughs> yeah. Even if it's just like. You kept your ring, right? Yeah, I kept my ring. Oh, thank you. I just don't like her wearing it. <laughs> yeah, I don't like you wearing it, but I resized it for my middle finger so I could so be like, like that. It's been almost a year and Lenny and I are still not divorced. I just don't know if my marriage is gonna survive. Is there anybody else involved? Because like, it's yes. Yes. There is somebody else. There's somebody else involved. I always knew. It's getting uglier by the day because I am contesting the prenup. And I get people sign prenups, but a lot of things have happened over the last 15 years. Jody, you have yeah. to, you have to get her another ring. But it doesn't even mean anything to me. Who cares? I just like it. It's a nice piece of jewelry. Yeah. Should I have been smarter? Yes. It's just it's like I haven't been hurt enough. I haven't been embarrassed and humiliated in front of the world. Should we go inside and get a bite? Yeah, let's do it. You look like you're getting married, by the way. Maybe that's a sign. One thing good that has come out of all of this is Jody. I need a refill. Jody is such an incredible person. Jody, do you ever get sick of the whole Lenny conversation? A yeah, lot, I, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you know, it, I know I told you. what kind of a guy you would you be if you couldn't, else. you know, if you couldn't be supportive when your girl's going through what? something like that? Yeah. I've really been leaning on him, maybe too much. And he's been so supportive. He himself, he's gone through a divorce. He's also from Canada. I look forward to the day when yes. it's not a conversation anymore. You know? Well, it's yeah. so fresh and I mean, it's happening in real time. You know? He's very so patient like, with me. Year. He puts up with so much. I'm a lot. I'm a lot. Am I a lot? You're, you're a lot of good stuff. You know? oh, you're right good stuff. I love you. I don't think I've ever had anyone look at me the way he does, ever, or love me this way. Like, I tell him all the time, he's getting the worst of me right now. I'm like, you just wait, because <laughs> if you like me now, you're gonna love me when this is all said and done.